Welcome to this review and instructions of the sunglasses spy camera. Now what appears to be a normal pair of sunglasses is actually a spy camera. Now, I'm going to give you an up close look and as you can see right there right in the top center is a tiny tiny lens right over there the large circle there's a lens in there right over there and the large circle in the center inside that circle is the lens that's the camera lens okay I'm going to give you a full in-depth look of the sunglasses spy camera Now all the functions and buttons that you use are on the left side. Right here. There's nothing on the right side. It's all on the left. Okay, so I'm going to show you how to use it. Now right over here is the power button. And here is the mode button. This is the microphone. Now you see that little hole? That's the mic right there. Right here is the USB port. To connect the USB cable, that connects to the computer and right over here is the micro SD card slot okay so to get started using the camera I'm going to install the micro SD card facing down Just insert it until you hear and feel a click. Like so. Now the memory card. And it is now installed properly. Now to turn the camera on, all you have to do is press the power button. You see the blue light? It's going to turn red. Right now, the camera is in video recording mode. Now to start recording a video, simply just push the power button and now you see it continuously blinking. This means it is now recording video. Now to stop recording video, just push the power button again. It blinks and then stops and right now it's in standby mode so once you push that it will save the video that you just took as an AVI file on the memory card now to take a photo with the camera while it's in standby mode push the camera button down as you can see it turned blue now once it's in blue it's in standby mode to take photos now to take a photo all you have to do is push the power button it blinks once you just took a photo press it again to take another photo blinks you took a second photo a third photo a fourth photo and so on and so forth Now to turn the camera off, all you have to do is press and hold the power button for two seconds, let go, 
and the camera is now off. Now to charge the camera, connect it to the computer with the USB cable. The red light is going to flash and when the red light stops flashing, the camera is charged. Let me give you a look at the USB cable. You simply just plug this in and plug this end into the computer. Now to retrieve the videos and photos that you took, after you plug this into the computer, you're going to see a drive pop up on your screen and in that drive you're going to see the videos as AVI files and the photos as JPEG files. So there is no driver or software required to take videos and photos with this camera. Okay, so I'm going to be taking some footage with the camera. I'm going to be testing the video, the sound, and I'm going to be taking some photos. So please stay tuned. Okay, this is a video and sound test of the sunglasses spy camera. I'm going to do a review to see how it turns out. Currently wearing it on my head right now, filming and I have a large size head. Seems to fit fine. feels comfortable and doesn't seem like anybody notices it at all that it's a spy camera I mean it just looks like an ordinary pair of sunglasses I'm going to be walking now and let's see how it films as I'm walking and turning my head. films as I'm running.
Okay, so there you have it. This was a full in-depth review and instructions of the Sunglasses Spy Camera. I hope you found this video useful. 